a sharpened blade within her hand, never hesitating to slay go within her way, creating calls of blood that followed her through Wonderland. Deep into the darkened forest, Alice walked the line, captured and imprisoned as an embodiment of sin. If it were not for the murderous wake left behind, no one would have suspected that she had ever been. The second Alice was a fragile man of the diamond, the broken echo of the lies within demented words. He sang his twisted melodies to all in Wonderland, creating the image of the sick and the disturbed. Deadly yet so beautiful, a voice just like a rose was shot by a madman who silenced him to death. Single rose bloomed in his place with no music composed. A twisted grin, this dying man lay breathing his last breath. The third Alice was an innocent young girl of club, an enchanting graceful figure in the world of wonderland. She charmed the people in the land to every beck and call. A peculiar country answering to each command. So she rose into the throne to be the country's queen. As this past two children walked in the woods, partaking in tea underneath the trees, they never part. They found an invitation to the queen. It was the Ace of Hearts. The fourth Alice was a duo of curiosity. Both were lost and could not find the boat where they began. And so they ran through countless open doors so recklessly. A brother and a sister running round through Wonderland. A stubborn elder sister, a witty younger brother. But they head straight too far into Alice's Wonderland. They were never woken from their terrifying dreams.